Björk, we have a mission for you, one of great importance and significance. There's a small world in the rock cluster, located at section 42, Octopus Bravo Lima Zebra 1 Tango. It's in the Gimp Belt constellation. The planet and its inhabitants are being wiped out by a zombifying pathogen called Glitch. It causes loss of sight, hearing, thought and speech. Glitch was released by their malevolent dictator leader as a last ditch attempt to control the uncontrollable and it backfired. Their cozy little flat earth is on the brink of absolute extinction and in two weeks the virus will have control of everyone. Time is of the essence. You've been chosen for this mission, Bjark, as you have a prolonged relationship with the inhabitants of Shenangonia. You must first meet the queen, be prepared for the unthinkable. She will guide you from there, Bjark. This is of the most importance. We've assembled a ship and crew. Bjark, don't fuck it up. Ten, nine, ignition sequence start. We thought we were so special. Then we realized the universe is a small world. <laughs> What the fuck was that? Brah! You know, like, someone fell from the sky and boof! Yeah, and the boys went out to see what it was. Ah, okay. Sick. First and foremost, cheers for coming tonight. It means a lot. Now, we've been through some shit in the last couple of years. The great seizure drought, the time that Boob got the clap, and let's not forget the great Why Not Wednesdays. Second, now I don't like getting sentimental and whatnot, but honestly, it's the last night of our lives, and I'm glad we can just relax and spend our last moments together to reflect. Shut up, loser. What a wanker. <laughs> Now stop being a gimtard. Check out what the heavens have said. Is that? Yep. Courtesy of Bjork. Fuck reflection. Bjork sent stardust. Jazz, grab some ding dongs. Let's fill up a baggie. It's time to go to town. Right. I think it's time for Flinders boys. Who's flying? Yeah, yeah. I will for sure. Shucks a cage, Greggy. I'm good to roll. All right. Let's fucking do this. Power up the old bird and let's vamoose! Alright everyone, pile in. Make room for the baggie. It's gonna be a little bit squishy. No thanks to your fat ass. <laughs> it's amazing what you can fit in the stallion. <laughs> well if it isn't the great Nommy. Boys, 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 how's it fucking going? How's it fucking going? No, we have the goods. Plan on having a cheeky sniff the susu. <laughs> yeah, boys, same here. Now we all know I have a big nose. Oh, yeah, tell me. <laughs> Your tits looking great tonight. <clears throat> oh, yeah, tonight. Stacy, you are legit my best friend. But you gotta act Joba as a sludge for the. <laughs> Bouncer. Oi, girls, ID. Sorry, two muzzin fellas, can't let you in. Mm, don't be a fucking dickhead, mate. It's the fucking end of the world, you power dripping grunt. Let us through for one final sniff, hey? <laughs> What's in the bag then? Fucking drugs, mate. And we are going to use every orifice in our body to consume them. Got a problem, pal? Now piss off and let us in.
Boob, Chaz, good to see you fellas. Old Marcus playing silly buggers again, eh? Give that bloke a chance. He's scared just like the rest of us, but he's a bit of an owner-operator. Get inside, have a drink. Have a happy last night, boys. He's gone, boys. Glitch got him good. Drinks. Right, Chaz, swings the doorbell. I'm already starting to come down a bit. Man, I think Bjark sent us duds. I haven't felt a thing since the house. I'm sober and almost ready for bed. You're full of shit, Boot. I'm cranky at the moment. I have third degree guns. Hey, maybe we should start calling you Dudley. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the Dud Father. But seriously, while Bjark sent us so much stardust, without even dropping in for a line or two for himself. It just seems curious, I guess. <laughs> Not that I'm complaining. Hey, look, isn't that sunshine roast? Chaz, you know, that hippie you and freak. Yeah, yeah, whatever, man. I told you, that was an unusual occasion. Where's this fucking canister then? We don't have all fucking night. I got this sexy little calculator back on the ship. She's gagging for some square rootin'. <laughs> oh, Bip, look. It's the canister. All but full. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. The Ark will not be pleased. <laughs> Tell me you found the canister. Well, we found the canister, but it's empty. Where are you? Send me your coordinates now. Okay, sending now, Bjark. I know where the contents are, the stupid fucks. I'm coming down, meet me at this address. Sure thing, Bjark. Of all the yards, why did it have to land in theirs? You're such a fucking brown noser. Bip, Bop, protect the ship while I'm away. If it gets dirty, I'll see you tomorrow. Tammy may be out. Alright mate, give it alright to me. Tell her that a bamboozki digit's still on my duchess. She'll get it. Get out of the way, Gimp. I need to get in. Find some unsavory souls. I did. What? Dude, I don't have any. I'm like 800 years old, you know, the whole starborn society. No ID, no entry. Dude, what's your problem? I saved your planet's hide like twice now. Show me some no, respect. No, you show me some fucking respect, you orange-skinned, octo-eyed, greasy, stinky-ass alien mongrel. So, okay, question. If a little fucking UFO was to fly down right now, buzz me without warning, then fly away, would you believe me if I told you and why? Go. No. I'd say you were on drugs or insane. And I would then say, give me some of what you want, because the last stuff hasn't done shit, man. Oi, lads, where's the powder? 10,745 caps, and to think there is only three left. Everyone in the club has had one. Oh, hey, the Ark. I have three caps here for you, big fella. 10,745 caps? You capped all the Zupanova and ate it? Zupanova? Isn't it star? No, it's Zupanova. Doesn't even get you high, you fucking apes. It's the ground up yuckball gland of our hive's queen. It's the damn cure to glitch. Our queen's life force gland can cure any incurable disease, but she dies in the process. 
I had to kill my queen to save you fools, and here you are snorting it! Ah! There was enough for your entire planet. You only needed a microdose to cure you. Hey, Chaz, you got the last caps? Yeah, mate. Here you are. Bjork, the supernova never made it to the mass dispenser relay of all the yards. It's up to these gimps to unite and repair the planet now. To strive forward and prosper in strength and equal values. You have failed to a degree, but I will not exile you, Bjark. Oh no. Your mission now is to observe and influence what's left of Shenanagonia. You will see them get through these times of trouble. You are now Bjark, guardian of the Gimps. moments that we miss.